Panoorin natin ang masaya at engranding receptions sa renewal of vows ng mag-asawang Heart Evangelista at Cheese Escudero sa Balisin Island nitong February 15 na nagsilbi na rin nilang 9th wedding anniversary. By the charge of God, I affirm your marriage covenant as husband and wife. She's, you may now kiss your wife. <laughs> Over the years, we've downsized a little bit from your original wedding, but I'd like to think that this is a more curated group yeah. of friends and family, and I hope that makes all of us feel truly special. Take a good look over there, love birds. Over the years, we've downsized a little bit from your original wedding, but I'd like to think that this is a more curated group of friends and family, and I hope that makes all of us feel truly special. With that, I will pass the microphone to Heart for some messages from the heart. Messages of welcome from all, from the new ones and to other guests. Nine years after, we're still partners, and I hope to be as rich as you also nine years after. I hope you will not be like me. <laughs> If you come to me, you won't be bald. <laughs> After nine years, cheese and heart looks younger. Yes. Iba kanina pinag-usama natin. True. Grabe, tira mo naman si heart. Super ganda, nakita mo? Grabe. Lalong gumanda ngayon. Ay si Cheese naman, lalong gumanda. Bakit po ka? Hindi lang. Alam mo, sa lalaki, ang importante sa lalaki, Cheese, is magaling, matalino, malakas.
successfully stole my heart. Massacred and chopped off the most precious piece of me and scattered it all over. As I woke up in pure panic, knowing how imminent it was not to be fearful, confused and enraged, gasping for air, I was left with only one thought lingering in my mind. Where can I find the one thing I valued the most? My heart went missing. The heart that contained most valuable memories from the deepest, darkest secrets to a whole universe with endless rooms filled with laughter and archives of the most saddest points I've ever written but was never meant to be read out loud. Songs for angels, soul-bonded lyrics from diaries of my childhood. How can I find my heart once more? I had a feeling of anger and resentment, but there was still an inkling of hope. Hope and faith was the reason I awoke. I was alive, but I never felt so alone. I knew one thing, that what the devil used for evil, God will use for good. And I always believed that I had a childlike faith to a fault at times, but I never stopped believing. And so I kept searching. After countless of emails, letters, and requests, sad to say I was never able to find my heart again. In life sometimes, we need some things to be hurtfully taken away in order for us to feel renewed and to be given a second life, a new beginning. And so in the end, I did get a response, a miracle. I was given a brand new heart, a heart that came with an upgrade to boot, stronger, bigger, wiser, and with freshly painted rooms. Getting married again, second time around, we're even now. <laughs> Still seems like it's actually my first. And I do truly believe it's actually my first time. Because I knew, I knew what love was before, but now I know what love should be. A lot of married people will resonate with what I'm saying as I stand here today in front of you as a testament that is, it's never actually too late. Nothing in life should be too late. It's all about God's perfect timing. And today is exactly that. I thank you for being the perfect example of what a husband should be. Yes, you are not perfect. You're not perfect. I'm just put that out there. But you are close to it. Oh yeah. You have proven what real love is. You waited. You accepted. And you had faith in the heart that I have today. Because only true love will remember the heart, no matter what season, no matter how long it took. You reminded me of who I am when I couldn't remember. They say earth angels are meant to struggle here and forget their power. And so I shall remind you every day that you have been one of the greatest archangels in my life. Your one true unique power is hidden in your golden heart, and that is unconditional love. That love healed a lot of people around you, and it has healed me. How my life would have been if you weren't around. You are not just a husband, but you are the greatest angel there is. God knew exactly what was going to happen in my life. So he had it mapped out even before I was born. And he made sure to send me one of his best angels because he knew one day I was going to meet someone exactly like you. So they say we meet people for a reason, a season, or a lifetime. And that many loves 
may come into our lives. But in the end, I will always be grateful for the time that we have shared together. I sold my soul and you bought it back for me. You have softened all the edges. You rearranged the stars and you have pulled them down to where I am. You have proven every word of my favorite love song can become a reality. And just like what I said before, I will love you and I will always love you with all my heart. By the charge of God, I affirm your marriage covenant as husband and wife. Let's give them another big hand. May the good Lord continue to rule and reign in your marriage and family. I pray that God's blessings and favor continue to overflow in your married life. And cheese, you may now kiss your wife. Yeah.